Hey guys, it's Giddy and I'm back and today's video is going to be a chit chat video slash update slash let's talk about the problems in the online community. So we'll start with where have I been? Um, I know the last time I filmed a video for this channel has been about two months ago and I just wanted to say I am so 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 sorry about that. I know it's been um it's been I've been really bad about that. I am so sorry. Um, it's not even lack of motivation, um, it's mainly I've just been really busy with real life. Like, I, um, my new work hours are from 10 to 7 p.m. And half the time, like, the majority of the time, I actually get overtime and I end up staying until like 8 a.m. Or not 8 a.m., 8 p.m. And by the time I get home, the light's gone. And it's just one of those things where I don't know what to do because I don't want to put out, like, bad quality videos because that's not what I want to do you know um and then what else so that's where I've been and then on my days off I just really want to relax and be a potato all day because I'm tired and life's hard you know like so YouTube has kind of been taking the back burner and I'm so sorry about that but I have noticed that you guys are still supporting my channel I still get comments every now and then I still you know get new subscribers and it's crazy to me like we're at 300 now and I haven't even uploaded in like two months and it's crazy to me and I want to thank you guys so much like I am so grateful that our, my little YouTube family is growing and I appreciate it so much so that's that um let's see now let's talk about problems in the online community and I'm not talking about like fet life I'm talking about Instagram and um Tumblr community for kitten play and pet play and little, the little side of the community as well, because, you know, let's just talk about it, shall we? Alright, so, where to start? Um, I just feel like the online community has really gone downhill. Like, recently there have just been so many cases of people being, like, really shitty to each other and tearing each other down. And it's just so sad, like, we're a community full of adults, and yet we're over here posting on anonymous blogs, hate about each other, and trying to tear each other down, and scamming people, and copying people's customs, and it's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, stop, you know what I mean? Like, don't, don't, don't do that, don't do that, no. So, where to begin? I guess we'll start to talk about customs. Um, I recently got a custom custom ears done from a shop and I was going to do an unboxing for you guys and I decided not to because at the time um recently someone shared their custom online you know on Instagram and then literally like a week or two later bam someone else had the exact same like custom done and it's just so sad because you know customs can mean a lot to people for some people it's not just a pair of ears um and it just got copied and I felt so bad because I knew how much, you know, her custom meant to her and it's just like, dude, you can't just copy people's customs, you don't know what they mean. And I'm not talking about customs that are like just generic, like, you know, the color scheme or like this breed. No, I'm talking about like, like legitimate customs where like intricate designs and piercings and just intricate personalized like design. You can't do that. You can't, like, steal someone's design and think it's okay. Like, it's not okay, you know? <laughs> like, people work hard on their designs, and the shop work, shops work hard to bring those designs to life. And for someone to just randomly, like, see your design online and just be like, hey, I want that too. I, it has no personal meaning to me, but I just like how it looks, so let me just go to this shop and have them do it. And it's not even the shop's fault. It's like... People are willingly caught, like, you know, copying other people's customs and it's not okay. So I recently got my custom done and, like I said, I was going to do an unboxing, but I decided against it because I don't feel comfortable sharing my customs anymore. And it's sad because I want to share things that are personal to me and things that I love, but I don't want other people seeing it and then taking it and just making an exact copy of it. It's just not okay and it's not cool and... Customs mean a lot to people, so please, you know, you yes, you can get inspiration, but don't heavily reference that. You know what I mean? Make, put your own spin on it. Do your own thing. I don't know. Be creative, you guys. <laughs> um, so, 
besides, there's been a lot of cases this going on recently, and it's just really, like, heartbreaking to me because it's sad that you can't share something that means a lot to you with the community because out of fear that someone else is going to take it. And the it's just, it's just not okay. Um, another thing that has been going on recently is there's been, like, an outbreak of scammers. Like, <laughs> for trick, because in the Kinflake community, you know, we have ears and stuff, and it's very common for us to trade ears with each other, and, you know, it just is what it is. Um, but lately, people have just been scamming and being mean, and it's just like, I just, I think it's so sad, you know what I mean? Like, it takes zero effort to be a decent person, and if you agree to trade a pair of ears with someone, it's just do your end of the, of the trade. Don't, like, get your end and then, like, not send out your part or send out something that's completely rude or offensive or, like, something completely different. It takes zero effort to be a decent person is what I'm trying to say. Like, and yeah, you may not like the person, but that doesn't mean they deserve to be, you know, robbed out of, like, a hundred bucks. You know what I mean? Because ears are expensive. Like, nobody deserves to be robbed out of 50, 100 bucks, whatever it may be, or, you know, having lost a set that meant a lot to them, and they get nothing in return, and it's just sad. Like, I don't know, I just feel like this community is just being overrun with, like, negativity, and we're just constantly trying to tear each other down because of petty reasons, and we should be trying to put more positivity out there and trying to support each other and build each other up teach each other learn from each other like the like the real life community is super nice and they're like trying to teach and they're trying to do their own thing and they're not concerned about being petty but I feel like the Instagram and Tumblr community are just so focused on like material things and being and not so much about the dynamic the dynamic or the lifestyle and it's just really sad to me um but yeah like <laughs> I don't know I just feel like it takes zero effort to be a decent person and it takes so much effort to go out of your way to be negative and spew out your negativity and I just I don't know it's just really sad to me um I don't know and I, those hate blogs are just so vicious like they, they're attacking people for like literally no reason and it's just really sad like we're supposed to be a, a community full of adults and we're acting like we're in middle school or like we're in high school and it's and it's not okay you know what i mean like it's just not okay we are adults can we act like adults i don't know but um and i know all of this sounds like really crazy especially if you're not involved in the online community like instagram or tumblr because i'm sure fet life is completely different i don't personally have fet life so i can't speak for it myself but you don't hear people on fet life doing like petty shit like this <laughs> I don't know um so I just I don't know I feel like I feel like we should be nicer to each other and support each other like maybe I don't know that's just me though um all right so I just that was just a rant um feel free to let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section if you if you've seen it or if you've experienced this um I, I just love to hear different opinions on the matter especially if you're involved um so yeah Another thing I want to talk to you guys about is upcoming videos and ideas. Um, as always, video suggestions are always welcome as long as they are within my content, area of content. Like, I'm not going to go out and do singing videos or like, or like weird request videos. Like, no, like as long as it's something that is currently on this channel or that falls within, within the content of this channel, then feel free to leave it down below. Whether it's Kim Play, DDLG, um, whatever related, that'd be cool. Um, I also have a future unboxing video for a collar from the King Collection. It recently just got shipped out to me, and I'm super duper excited about it, so I'm going to do an unboxing for you guys. I also have um, refurbished ears coming to me from Hoshikins. You know, I love her to death. She's pens down my favorite shop, and it's so sad that it's so hard, impossible to get ears from her. <laughs> but that's a whole other topic. That's a whole other video. Um... Yeah, I'm getting those, and I'll be happy to show you guys the refurbishment and before and after pictures, and that's really fun and exciting. Um, yeah, so I'll leave video suggestions. Um, <laughs> what else was I going to talk about? I don't know. I think I already thanked you guys for 300 subscribers. I think that was, like, thanks. Support on point, you guys. Um, and... 
I feel like uh, there was something else I wanted to say in this video and it's gonna kill me because the moment I turn off the recording I'm gonna remember and it's just gonna be like oh yeah um also follow me on my social medias if you haven't already I'm more act I'm mostly active on Instagram um and that's where you guys could see more pictures stories and it's just an easier way to get into contact with me um like I said I'm more active on there than I am on here obviously but um yeah more videos are coming soon and I appreciate your support as always links to um my social medias thingies will be down below if you want to give it a follow then do I would love to have you <laughs> um yeah and then again video suggestions are always welcome and thank you guys as always for your support um if you haven't already feel free to subscribe to my channel I'd love to have you on here and um yeah I'll talk to you guys in the next video hope you guys have been well all right bye bye